Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be watching American presidential elections reduced to a circus by um, Akash. Oh, I don't, I don't know what this guy's name. Oh, Akash bon, Bonner G and Oddwaith. Listen again. I don't. <laughs> I'm not good when it comes to names. The channel is the Desh Deshpot Desh Deshpot Deshbot 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 Desibot 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 maybe I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> has the American presidential election been reduced to a circus? Um, yeah, it kind of has. It, it it's been that way for a while now. To be truthfully honest with you. Um, but I'm actually interested in seeing a uh, Indian perspective. You know, I, I've I've given my perspective on a lot of the political going ons over in India this past year. So I'm I'm actually really interested in, in hearing a bit more from the Indian side of things as well. So um, we're gonna watch this channel today. This video, the link to this video will be in the description down below. And if you uh, want me to watch and react to other videos, let me know too, and uh, we'll see. Well, we can see, but yeah, um, this time, whatever happens in America, the White House will have a South Indian Tiffin. Uh, I don't know what Tiffin is. <laughs> we're going to be listening to subtitles. We're listening. To, we're going to be reading the subtitles because um, uh, the person doesn't speak English in the video from what I've seen. But yeah, either way, um, he, the, the, what, what he's referring to as South Indian is Kamala Harris is um, half Tamil, I believe, and... The vice presidential pick for Trump uh, is married to uh, an Indian uh, lady. I don't know where she's from. Apparently, she's from the South as well, though. So, um, But yeah, I mean, there was always going to be a chance of that. There's a rising chance of that. I mean, I know a really strong contender for the Republican side of things that I think should have stayed in the race um, is uh, Vivek, v Vivek Ram Ramswamy. Um, and there's a few others as well, even over on the uh, like the 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 Democratic side as well. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, we'll uh, <laughs> we'll go ahead and watch this video. I just got out of the shower, so I apologize. My hair's a little wet. It's just gonna be a little funky for this one. इस बार अमेरिका में चाहे जो जीते व्हाइट हाउस में साउथ इंडियन टिफिन तो बन कर रहेगा साउथ इंडियन फिल्टर कॉफी क्रिस्पी मसाला डोसा और गर्मा गर्म. Okay. Sambar. Coffee sounds pretty good. I have some coffee. I need to go get some coffee. Um, don't know what the rest of this is, but it looks pretty decent. U.S. की history में पहली बार ऐसा हुआ है कि एक South Asian descent का व्यक्ति presidential post की दावेदार है, पर सिर्फ Democratic presidential nominee Kamala Harris की बात नहीं कर रहा हूँ. Republican vice presidential nominee J.D. Vance की पत्नी भी Indian descent की है. Kamala Harris के roots Chennai से हैं और Usha Chilkuri के roots Andhra से हैं. Oh, okay, Andhra. Oh, um, yeah, Kamala Harris as well. I mean, yeah, she's half, she's half Indian, half Jamaican, which is which is an interesting combo because uh, right now she's like going on tour and and saying that she's like a black American and she's like in, in, I've seen interviews and it's just it, again it goes back to the circus thing I've seen interviews with her and she's talking in like uh, ebonics that typically that um, black Americans talk in in like poor areas uh, it, it, it's it's ridiculous because. You know she's just putting on a show. I hate I hate how politicians are always putting on shows. You know, it's it's it's, it's demeaning in a way, right? Yes, about WhatsApp University पर पता ही चल गया होगा कि ऋषि सोनक चले गए तो क्या हुआ? अमेरिका में ऑपरेशन कमला होने वाला है. Yeah, and everyone's making fun of this laugh as well. Her laugh is. It's it's terrible. It's it's even worse than my laugh. <laughs> um. Kamala Didi ki isi hasi par Trump ne unko laughing Kamala bulaya hai. Par sachai to ye hai ki aaj ke date. Wait wait wait. What was that? Isi hasi par Trump ne unko laughing Kamala. Trump's campaign works convince voters that Harris is crazy because of her laugh. She just she just doesn't have a very nice laugh. I don't think she's crazy. The crazy aspect of Kamala Harris, Kamala Harris. Um, is the fact that like she's she's just like hard leaning like cop, but she's running on the side of like the Democrats and, and right now typically the Democrats are very like defund police, um, 
and and very very much so against cops and she was a prosecutor over in like san francisco for a long time and she she did some heinous things i mean she would she would make make sure to prosecute and keep uh criminals in for like small things of like having weed for example um and yeah, I mean, she's done a lot of bad things. I mean, Trump's about done a lot of bad things as well. Don't get don't get me wrong. I mean, I can go all every day, go on all day about how Trump's. Yeah, yeah, see, this is the thing. This is the thing. This is the thing with the U.S. politics. It's like, why is it these two people, out of everyone that could have possibly have been chosen for a presidential candidate, why these two people? Anyways, I'm sure he'll go over a lot of the things that I want to go over. So, we'll touch upon them when it comes. बुलाया है पर सच्चाई तो यह है कि आज के डेट में अगर कोई भी अमेरिकन इलेक्शन को फॉलो कर रहा होगा तो उसे ऐसी ही हंसी आएगी अमेरिकन प्रेसिडेंशियल इलेक्शन अब एक लाफ्टर चैलेंज ही बन गया है इन 2020 एक तरफ 81 ईयर ओल्ड का एक प्रेसिडेंट जिसके बात करने के अंदाज से लगता Eight, eight, yes, again, 81. Okay, I can go about ages as well. <laughs> um, 81 year old who looks like he's permanently three pegs down, so old he sees ghosts. Yes, he, he's, he's a clearly, clearly, extremely old man at this point, and he needs to have retired 10 plus years ago. Uh, Trump is like 80 years old, 79, 80 years old. Kamala Harris is 59, so if she wins, she'll be 60 years old when she's in office. You know what the crazy thing is? Barack Obama. When he was president, he was um, he was forty seven years old. So he's sixty three right now. He's he's literally just shy, just over the age of Kamala Harris. I mean, if if, if it wasn't a two term limit thing, he could be running. And before that, we had uh, George W. Bush, um, who at the time of uh, uh, becoming president, he was like fifty four. Um, and before that, we had Bill Clinton, who was forty six. So it's like, what is going on? <laughs> what is what is going on? If you look throughout the history of the presidential uh, presidential elections for the U.S., the vast majority of U.S. presidents have been between the 40s and their 50s. I think the median age is like 53 to 55 is the average age for presidents. Now, we've had some older presidents, of course, Biden um, and Trump. Um, and then before that, we had a couple that were in their 60s, but... Crazy. Anyways, we're a minute into the video. Let's keep going. That's why permanently teen peg down. Yeah. He's, 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 he's rough. Who's rough? 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 Doing the two hand thing, I don't know. Yeah, he was impeached, and um, he was he's 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 a he's a felon right now for um like lying about business and taxes and stuff in New York, New York City. Yeah. भद्दे चीजें बोल चुका है कि अब Nobody cares, लोगों को yeah. भी फर्क पड़ना बंद हो चुका है उसके ऊपर ट्रंप के वाइस प्रेसिडेंशियल रनिंग मेट भी कुछ उनसे कम नहीं है सिरिकल जेसी यू हैव दीस पीपल हु आर लाइक व्हाई इज द प्रेसिडेंट वेयरिंग एन ईयर बैंडेज ही गॉट शॉट इन द ईयर एंड दीस आर द सेम पीपल हु आर वेयरिंग मास्क्स राइट 5 इयर्स आफ्टर कोविड सो इट्स प्रीटी रिडिकुलस उसके ऊपर वेंस इज इंटरेस्टिंग नो दिस इज दिस इज फेक आई कैन ऑल राइट सो द वायरल न्यूज़ दैट वेंस डिड बैड डीन्स विद द सोफा ही ही बेटर से इट्स फेक बिकॉज़ इट्स इट्स इट इज फेक दिस इज दिस इज लाइक लेजिटिमेट मिस इंफॉर्मेशन और सोशल मीडिया पर ये वायरल न्यूज़ कि वेंस ने अपने सोफे के साथ दुष्कर्म किए थे डज ही से दैट इट्स फेक बिकॉज़ इट इज फेक दिस दिस वाज दिस वाज अ अ प्रूवन लाइ बाय अ अ कमेंटर ऑन ट्विटर so here's a fact check over on Snopes. Uh, no, J.D. Vance did not say he had sex with the couch cushions. Uh, this is proven false. On July 15, 2024, uh, user Rick Rudcavs Rude posted that Republican U.S. Senator J.D. Vance of Ohio wrote in 2016 memoir, Hillbilly Elegy, 
A memoir of a family and culture in crisis about thrusting his penis into an inside-out latex glove shoved in between two couch cushions. That user created the post on the same day former U.S. President Donald Trump announced Vance as his 2024 vice presidential running mate. The user's post read, Can't say for sure, but I might. Um, it might be the v first VP pick to have admitted to in his New York Times bestseller to fucking an inside-out latex glove shoved between two couch cushions. Um... The rumor was false. Remember, the, the rumor was false by Snopes, and Snopes is very uh, left-leaning, so you can trust this. Vance's memoir contained no such passage, including the first edition, as we later reported in a second article further, as Know Your Meme reported Rick Rude's calves, who later protected his account so only followers could see his post, signaled that he was jo uh, joking when he followed up the tweet with Go on the internet and tell lies meme. So, yeah. It is, it is fake. 2024. He does not say it in the video. Okay. All right. Let me, that's, that, that's, that's a bit upsetting, but it is what it is. 2024 is the year of elections. Yes. Look, look at all. 54 democratic elections. Crazy. साल रहा है लेकिन दुनिया का सुपर पावर यूएसए ने तय किया है कि उसका सबसे ज्यादा ट्रैजी कॉमेडी वाला इलेक्शन होने वाला है स्वागत है आपका ट्राई नॉट टू लाफ चैलेंज अमेरिकन इलेक्शन एडिशन में okay. एक ऐसा इलेक्शन जहां जो भी जीते और जो भी हारे अमेरिका की रेप्यूटेशन उसकी डेमोक्रेटिक स्टैंडिंग तो नीचे ही जाने वाली है रेप्यूटेशन फॉर डेमोक्रेटिक स्टैंडिंग ऑफ अमेरिका विल बी डिस्ट्रॉयड नो मैटर हु विंस I, I, I would agree, but you gotta also realize that the president doesn't really have too much power. The U.S. is run with a with with three sides of government. You have the uh, you have the president, you have Congress, you have the judicial branches. So it's it's the president really is just a figurehead of his political party. He he doesn't actually hold the, as much power. Uh, as a lot of people think most of the power comes through the congress which is the the senate and the house um and then of course the judicial branches the judges the supreme court that's why in my personal opinion choosing your senator choosing who your 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 your, your house representative is is going to be the most important now the president does have a say on who can be a who can go up for appointment to become a uh, Supreme Court judge. But, you know, that still has to be voted in via the, the House and the, and, and the Senate. So, the more, more importantly is, is voting for your Senate, for your, st for your state you're in, not necessarily the president. The president could be, you know, he could become elected and just be a lame duck president because the, 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 the Congress has more power. So... Yeah, either way, it's weird. समझाता हूँ कैसे आज के एपिसोड में यूएस प्रेसिडेंशियल इलेक्शन के लिए वोटिंग नवंबर 5 2024 को होने वाली है मगर कैंपेन जोर शोर से अभी से शुरू हो चुकी है यूएसए में प्रेसिडेंशियल सिस्टम इलेक्शन होता है डायरेक्ट हेड ऑन हेड फाइट माने जनता डायरेक्टली देश के प्रेसिडेंट के लिए वोट करती है एक रोबस्ट डेमोक्रेसी कह सकते हो जहां सिर्फ दो पार्टियां हैं और दोनों ही वही दोनों को ही वही कॉर्पोरेट फंड करती है आजकल अमेरिका के दी सुपर पैक्स दैट um push to make things happen in the US ke logo ko samajh mein aa raha hai ki ye two party system utna acha bhi nahi hai unke paas aur koi option hi nahi hai 12th march i mean it is a two party system technically there are many parties but the two parties are the parties that have the most political power and political standing like me myself i like to see myself as like the forward party which is a party that dedicated to bridging the gap between the two main parties but there's many political parties, like the Libertarian Party, the Green Party. It's just they don't they don't see enough leverage into making it big on the race. आज को सिटिंग अमेरिकन प्रेसिडेंट जो बाइडेन डेमोक्रेटिक पार्टी के प्रेजेंटिव नॉमिनी बन जाते हैं. डेमोक्रेट्स को लगा कि अब की बार फिर से बाइडेन सरकार. मगर जब ही उन्हें और उनके डोनर्स को शक होने लगा कि शायद बाइडेन इज नॉट द बेस्ट चॉइस. He's too old. He's too old. He, he's become slow, he talks very slowly, he's very forgetful, and yes, of course, he does have a stutter, and he's always had a stutter, but it's become even more pronounced with age, and it's just another thing that can that, that uh, the opposite side can use to attack him. Because Biden's age is a little slow. 
बाइडन चीजें भूल जाते थे एनर्जी लेवल्स डाउन होने लगी अक्सर बातें मिक्सअप कर देते हवा के साथ हैंडशेक करते और शायद अलग अलग परफॉर्मेंस इनहेंसिंग ड्रग्स के बावजूद उनके मार्गदर्शक yeah. मंडल में जाने का समय हो चुका था 28 जून 2023 में बाइडेन ने कह दिया था कि पुतिन जंग हार रहे हैं यूक्रेन में नहीं इराक में made a lot of mistakes like that and you can't have somebody that's talking to other political leaders around the world make mistakes like that like uh he recently called um the president of ukraine uh putin president uh president putin uh it was the president of ukraine which is a huge blunder <laughs> called the egyptian president yeah he called the egyptian president the president of mexico that that's true he did that as well in 2024 ko egypt ke president el sisi ko mexico ka president bula diya as you know initially The president of Mexico, Sisi, did not want to open up the gate to allow humanitarian material to get in. Crazy. I talked to him. Crazy. I can Crazy. But then, but then, he also said that there is a lot of confusion. Biden is absolutely right. Ukraine and Iraq can confuse each other. Which is the biggest problem? Tell me. 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 एक तरफ ट्रंप 78 इयर्स के और एक तरफ बाइडेन ट्रंप 78 इंटरेस्टिंग आई थॉट इट वाज 79 या 80 स्टिल टू ओल्ड के देखिए अमेरिका के पास कितने सारे ऑप्शंस है प्रेसिडेंट के और यहां लेकिन बाइडेन का दिमाग ने जवाब दे दिया दैट वाज वियर्ड इमिग्रेशन के मुद्दे पर बात करते हुए बाइडेन थोड़ा फंबल किए और ट्रंप ने मौके पर चौका मार दिया टोटल इनिशिएटिव रिलेटिव टू व्हाट वी कैन डू विद मोर बॉर्डर पेट्रोल एंड मोर असाइन ऑफ प्रेसिडेंट ट्रंप आई रियली डोंट नो व्हाट ही सेड एट द एंड ऑफ दैट सेंटेंस आई डोंट थिंक ही नोस व्हाट ही सेड इदर मैं नहीं दैट वाज प्रीटी फनी दैट वाज प्रीटी फनी यू कुड जस्ट लाइक दैट होल डिबेट वाज वाज जस्ट अ शोकेस ऑफ हाउ नॉट देयर बाइडेन वाज एनीमोर जानता कि बाइडेन ने क्या बोला बाइडेन खुद भी शहर शायद नहीं जानता है कि उसने क्या बोला यह बात कह के बिलेनर ट्रंप ने पहली बार आम आदमी के साथ एक रिलेटेबिलिटी बैठाई क्योंकि बाइडेन की बात शायद किसी को समझ में नहीं आई एक और जगह टैक्सेशन और हेल्थ केयर की बात हो रही थी बाइडेन ने फिर कह दिया मेकिंग श्योर दैट वी आर एबल टू मेक एवरी सिंगल सॉलिटरी पर्सन एलिजिबल फॉर व्हाट आई हैव बीन एबल टू डू विद द विद विद द कोविड एक्सक्यूज मी विद मदद की और मेडिकेयर को हरा दिया ये डिबेट ट्रंप के लिए एक वॉक ओवर था पॉलिसी या परफॉर्मेंस पर नहीं बस इस मेट्रिक पर कि ट्रंप कम से कम पूरे सेंटेंसेस तो बोल पाता है वाओ इट्स इट्स अमेजिंग दैट वी आर इवैल्यूएटिंग आवर प्रेसिडेंशियल कैंडिडेट्स ऑन द एबिलिटी टू स्पीक फुल सेंटेंसेस वाओ एक ट्रस्टेड पोल प्रोडिक्शन के फोरकास्ट के मुताबिक डिबेट से पहले बाइडेन दादा के जीतने के आई डोंट आई डोंट इट डजंट मैटर एनी ऑफ दिस पोल्स आई 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 हाईली डिसएग्री विद एवरी सिंगल वन ऑफ दिस पोल्स एवरी सिंगल मेट्रिक ऑफ दिस पोल्स दैट आर पुट आउट इवन इफ दे आर गुड और बैड फॉर लाइक एनी पर्टिकुलर कैंडिडेट दैट आई वांट बिकॉज़ दिस पोल्स हु आर दे पोलिंग Who are these polls polling? In all my years, I've never been asked to do a poll. I've never known anybody that's done a poll. Where, where, where are these pollers coming from, right? What are these? Where are these these news sites and these these polling places polling people? They need to do, they need to disparage that content better because anybody can go up and say, yeah, I interviewed. Thousand people, and oh, look at this! You know, Trump's—he's uh, up by ninety percent. Crazy! That's a thousand people. That's that's a whole metric of the U.S., right? I I just I don't I don't like I don't like these polls. There needs to be I don't know something better. The chances thirty four point seven percent थे और debate के बाद twenty seven point three percent हो गए दस प्रतिशत नीचे एक debate के वजह से. 
बाइडेन डटे रहे कि मैं हार नहीं मानूंगा उल्टा ये बोलने लगे कि नहीं नहीं मेरा दिमाग एकदम बढ़िया चल रहा है पर फिर उन्होंने 11 जुलाई को एक प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस की जिसमें यूक्रेन के प्रेसिडेंट जेलेंस्की को स्टेज yeah, पे बुलाते हुए गलती से मिस्टेक कर दी determination ladies and gentlemen president putin president putin you got beat president putin president zelensky pehle hi america ukraine ka sara paisa israel ko de rahi man it's just that's that's super embarrassing it hi upar se zelensky ko sabke samne putin bol diya chi 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 is sabke baad bhi kisi journalist ne pucha ki kya aap isliye drop out nahi karna chahte ho kyunki aapko lagta hai ki vice president kamala harris trump ko presidential race mein nahi hara payenge is pe biden ne bade confidence se jawab diya look i wouldn't have picked vice president trump to be vice president i forgot about this but yeah <laughs> he called kamala harris president vice president trump Oh my god. I wouldn't have picked Vice President Trump to be Vice President. Do I think she's not qualified to be president? So let's start there. <laughs> oh my Aray, god. Biden dada, Vice President Trump nahi. Aapki Vice President Kamala Harris hai. Ek sentence mein do naam to Biden ka dimag ho gaya confused. <laughs> What is this? What is this? What is this? Is it must be from a, a movie. I, this is weird. Bhula. Is <laughs> sabke saath saath okay. Biden ne ek bhoot bhi dekh liya. I'm going to go to South Korea and we're going to get the chip. What are you doing? I'm going to get Japan and Korea. Is shayad wohi wala bhoot jisse wo हाथ मिलाने की कोशिश कर रहे थे इस कॉमेडी शो में सबसे ज्यादा खुश ट्रंप हुए जो बाइडेन को जब भी देखते तो उनके मन में लड्डू फूटते बेटा मन में लड्डू फूटा क्योंकि and he ripped open his shirt and there was a make america great again shirt underneath for for trump and it's like that's weird and then it, it, the camera panned to trump and trump's like pumping his fists in the air and he starts blowing a kiss to hulk hogan and you're like what is what what what's even <laughs> what's even going on man <sighs> एनीवेज कि बाइडेन मानो ना मानो कहीं ना कहीं ट्रंप को वॉक ओवर दे चुके थे इलेक्शन होने से महीनों पहले और डेमोक्रेट्स भी अपने बाल नोच रहे थे ये सोचते सोचते कि इस ऑरेंज बालों वाले ट्रंप को हराते हराते हराने की कोशिश में हम गंजे हो जाएंगे क्योंकि पॉलिटिक्स चीज ही ऐसी है इतना स्ट्रेस देती है कि आपके बाल झड़ जाते हैं लेकिन अगर आपका स्ट्रेस या किसी और वजह से हेयर लॉस हो रहा है तो एक उपाय है और उपाय का नाम है ट्राया वेबसाइट ले लीजिए जो भी आप कंफर्टेबल है यहाँ आप एक हेयर टेस्ट करा सकते हैं जो कोने में भी आप got a widow's peak going on I'm old though so I mean I don't really care if if I'm getting to the point where I'm about to be bald I'm gonna shave it all off I don't care कर सकते हैं और आपका इससे एक हेयर लॉस एनालिसिस होता है एनालिसिस करवा कर आप एक कस्टमाइज oh, हेयर ग्रोथ रूटीन खरीद सकते हैं really रूटीन में आपको मिलता that है डर्मेटोलॉजिस्ट के पूर्व प्रोडक्ट्स सहित सप्लीमेंट्स और हेयर कोच असिस्टेंस भी आपको मिलता है ये रूटीन पांच से छह महीने लगातार यूजर्स को विजिबल रिजल्ट्स दिखे हैं ऐसे ही कोई क्लेम आपको नहीं देना चाहते हैं इसके लिए इनके टीम ने हमें वेरीफाई किया है पता लगाया है कि Well, I'm not going to discredit this guy's thing. Um it could work. I you know what? Check it out. I always you know I always this is one thing I like to do whenever I'm reacting to a video. I like the sponsor segments to to play through, you know. I don't I know I see a lot of other reaction channels like skipping the sponsor segments, but Yeah, you're you're reacting to their video. The least you could do is at least, you know, get their sponsor segment out there, right? And there's probably like a code for him. Yeah, go go to that code if you want try it. कंज्यूमर रिसर्च डेटा भी इस दावे को बैक करता है आप भी अगर ट्राई ट्राई करना चाहते हैं तो उनके वेबसाइट या ऐप को चेक कर सकते हैं लिंक्स मैंने नीचे डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स पे दिए हुए हैं बैक टू द स्टोरी अब होता है कहानी में ट्विस्ट ट्रंप के साथ होता है एक हादसा जुलाई 
2024 बटलर काउंटी पेंसिल्वेनिया में एक रैली के दौरान ट्रंप पर गोली चलाई जाती है गोली चलाने वाला 20 साल का नौजवान थॉमस मैथ्यू क्रुक्स था रैली की क्राउड से एक इंसान की मौत होती है दो लोग क्रिटिकली इंजर होते हैं ट्रंप बाल बाल बचते हैं गोली उनके कान से लगकर जाती है जब ट्रंप को सीक्रेट सर्विस एजेंट स्टेज से बाहर ले जा रहे होते हैं तब उसी समय वो अपनी बंड मुट्ठी उठाकर इनकलाब जिंदाबाद वाली एक फील दे देते हैं उसकी yeah. एक तस्वीर ली जाती है और हर जगह ये पिक्चर वायरल हो जाती है और इलेक्शन मानो बाय बाय टाटा क्यों हुआ था किसने करवाया था इस पर कई सवाल उठे हैं जैसे गोली जो चलाई गई जिसने चलाया गोली वो एक रजिस्टर्ड रिपब्लिकन वोटर था मैंने रजिस्टर्ड राइट विंगर था ऊपर से ओके सो ही डजेंट गो इन डिटेल अबाउट दैट ही वॉज रजिस्टर्ड एज ए रिपब्लिकन वोटर बट ही ऑल्सो है डोनेटेड टू द the democratic party as well so he it, it appears to be the case when he first turned 18 he registered as a republican probably because his family was republican but uh based off of him donating and his online presence he was actually more democratic leaning probably more centrist than anything else but Yeah, he wasn't he wasn't a re- Republican so to speak. And no, I don't think that he was hired by the US government to do it. But I wonder if he'll say anything about that. Ha goli, wo ek registered Republican voter tha. मैंने रजिस्टर्ड राइट विंगर था ऊपर से सीक्रेट सर्विस क्या कर रही थी इतनी बुद्धू थी Yeah, okay. So the secret service, it was stupid that they didn't see a boy with a gun. No, they, they did see him. They did see him. They just didn't do anything about it. को सामने सामने बिल्डिंग के ऊपर छत पर बंदूक ताने एक लड़का नहीं दिखा खैर इस पर तो कई थियोरीज हैं थियोरीज की कोई कमी नहीं है अभी तो यह बात सामने आ रही है कि ट्रंप का गोली वाला कान भी बिल्कुल ठीक हो गया है ए ये ट्रंप न्यू फोटोज अपीयर टू शो जॉन टॉप्स ईयर हैव कंप्लीटली हीलड वेल दिस इज दिस इज नॉट इवन दैट द राइट साइड आई डोंट थिंक आई हैव एवर सीन एनीथिंग लाइक दिस आई मीन इट्स इट इट क्लिप्ड हिज ईयर It's literally, you know, centimeters away from death. So if it just if it just clipped his ear, of course, yeah, it's probably going to be fine. And you know what? They pro- there's probably a plastic plastic surgery and and got it fixed. You knowing him, yeah, plastic surgery probably was like the first thing he was thinking about. Trump is not a human. He is non-biological. He is a Ishwar's vardan. He looks like he is. मगर इस घटना के बाद यह साफ हो गया कि भाई इस हालत no, में बाइडेन was, तो was, को कहीं इट वॉज क्लियर बिफोर इवन दैट से भी हरा नहीं पाएगा डेमोक्रेटिक पार्टी के बड़े बड़े डोनर्स इतनी आसानी से लेकिन हार नहीं मानने वाले थे उन्होंने ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट ऑफ जुलाई को बाइडेन को रिटायर करवा दिया इलेक्शन कैंपेन के बीच फाइंड माई सेल्फ डूइंग दैट all the time and i don't mean to do it but now he's doing it and i'm hearing it and it makes me want to do it mm, okay which may he retire as a us itihas mein pehle kabhi nahi hua hai 21st july ko hi kamala harris ne apna presidential campaign shuru kar diya vice president ka experience tha aur bhule bisre biden ko aksar kamala hi sambhalti thi biden ne aur kafi sare democratic party leaders ne openly support kiya kamala harris ko aur mano ki trump ka dil toot gaya are uske campaign ki हवा निकल गई जो रिपब्लिकन पार्टी इकोसिस्टम अब तक कह रही थी कि बाइडेन इज टू ओल्ड एक झटके में ओपोनेंट 59 नाइन ईयर ओल्ड कमला अब वो हो गई और बूढ़े कैंडिडेट ट्रंप बन गए इवन आई इवन थिंक कैमला हैरिस इज टू ओल्ड आई रियली डू कैन शी बी 60 बट इफ शी वर टू विन शी बी 60 इयर्स ओल्ड बाय द टाइम शी इज इन ऑफिस राइट एंड आई इवन आई थिंक दैट्स टू ओल्ड आई आई ऑनेस्टली ट्रूथफुली थिंक दैट द प्रेसिडेंट शुड बी इन देयर 40स एंड 50स throughout their candidacy ai master stroke <laughs> trump ke muqable kamala harris ki ek clean chhavi hai trump ke muqable kisi ki bhi chhavi clean hogi unke papa donald j harris jamaica se hain aur unki maa shyama gopalan 19 saal ki umar mein us shift ki thi dono university professors aur researchers the kamala ka janam oakland california mein hua hmm. unhone law mein career banaya 2003 mein san francisco ki district attorney 2010 mein attorney general 2016 mein california se us senate mein chuni gayi 
2020 के प्रेसिडेंशियल रेस में उन्होंने कंपीट करने का सोचा लेकिन इंटरेस्टिंग ही डिन टॉक अबाउट सम ऑफ द अदर थिंग्स सो इट इज नोन दैट कैमला हैरिस डिड सम अनसेवरी थिंग्स सो दिस इज व्हाट आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट कैमला हैरिस वाज विली ब्राउन्स मिस्ट्रेस एंड ही मेड हर करियर सो Back in the 90s, Kamala Harris um had an affair or dated this guy who was 30 years her senior. She was 29 and he was uh, 59 and he basically appointed her into the pos- the political positions where she had power. Um now this is a mixture of truth here. Uh what's true? Harris dated former Willie Brown in 1994 1995 as the state assembly speaker. Brown appointed her to political posts. So she dated her way into her political power back then the you know, the california unemployment insurance appeals board and later uh the medical assistant commissions so she got her start by dating her way to those points of power now what's false is the fact that this guy wasn't married so uh while brown was still married when he and harris started to date he and his wife uh, uh He and his wife Blanche Brown had separated 13 years by then. Fares his first successful run for office in 2003 happened 8 years after the relationship ended. Since then Harris and Brown have taken several opportunities to distance themselves from each other. So yeah, it's um uh <laughs> disagree she actually did sleep her way into an upwards in California politics and most women and men many learn that see it for what it is evidence of an unqualified political aspirant getting ahead based on something other than merit it's relevant and fair game by Megan Kelly interesting so yeah she she got her start by via very unsavory means किन ड्रॉप आउट कर गई और जो बाइडेन की वाइस प्रेसिडेंशियल नॉमिनी बन गई ग्रीन न्यू डील अफोर्डेबल कॉलेज अबॉर्शन राइट्स जैसे मुद्दों पर उन्होंने काफी काम किया है और सबसे ज्यादा क्वालिफिकेशन वो बातें वो सेंटेंसेस पूरा बोल सकती हैं बिना भूले कमला ने एक दिन के अंदर ही रिकॉर्ड ब्रेकिंग टू मिलियन डॉलर फंड रेजिंग कर दी who cares how much money they make like in in the, the whole this whole thing was like trump was like oh after he got shot he raised like 190 million dollars it's like who cares how much money you're raising like what 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 merit does that have on a political position like why 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 पॉलिटिकल डोनेशन के जरिए खजाना खुल गया कमला हैरिस के लिए और सडनली यूएस इलेक्शन में पासा पलट गया अब सारा फोकस कमला हैरिस पर मानो कि एसेसिनेशन अटेम्प्ट कुछ ही दिन हो पहले वाला हुआ ही नहीं था अब ऐसे अपोनेंट को देखकर डोनाल्ड yeah. ट्रंप एकदम तिलबिला उठे Again, I he was making fun of like a disabled person when he was doing this. So <laughs> it's a little weird. Uh, uh, mom, I'm sorry. Uh, mom, I didn't do it. मतलब बाइडेन के बदले कमला वर्स्ट ट्रेड इन द हिस्ट्री ऑफ ट्रेड्स इतनी खराब डील तो कहीं नहीं हुई है रिपब्लिकन पार्टी के साथ उन्होंने कहा फ्रॉड हो गया है उन्हें रीइंबर्समेंट चाहिए कि इतना पैसा उन्होंने खर्च किया बाइडेन के खिलाफ लड़ते हुए अब ट्रंप इतना तिलविला उठे इतना गुस्सा हो उठे कि ट्रंप की खुद की नीस कह रही है कि अंकल घबरा गए हैं आई डोंट थिंक आई हैव नीस और अब तो बाइडेन Mary L Trump I've never heard of Mary L Trump my uncle is panicking he's running against a strong black woman I thought she was Indian Indian and Jamaican uh and former prosecutor who isn't afraid to call him out or mock him his whole campaign strategy was based uh around attacking Joe Biden his age his infirm- infirmity his cognitive decline it was all projection of course but because president biden is old um is old and has slowed down the last 4 years and because he doesn't sh- shout or bully Donald was able to make the attack stick thanks Donald was able to make the attack stick thanks in large part to his foot soldiers in the corporate media I've never heard of Mary L Trump this is the, this is the first time as an American I've ever heard of Mary L Trump नहीं कमला को टक्कर देना होगा जो कि एक स्ट्रॉन्ग ब्लैक वोमन प्रोसिक्यूटर भी है खैर उनके वोमन हुड का भी काफी मजाक उड़ाया गया है इस प्रेसिडेंशियल डिबेट में कुछ प्रेसिडेंशियल नहीं है। 
इस डिबेट में लुच्चे लफंगों की लेवल की डिबेट चल रही है ट्रंप वही कर रहा है जो हर घबराया हुआ राइट विंग इंसान करता है कमला को नाम बुलाना उसको टीज करना अर्बन नैक्सो वट इज अर्बन नैक्सो मीन और अर्बन नक्सल का करार दे देना gets in she would be the most radical far left extremist ever to occupy the white house times 10 there's never been a lunatic like this in the white house she's a cop she was a prosecutor far left extremist i'm surprised the far left would even vote for her that's the thing it's like she's very strong on policing she's she <laughs> i don't Okay. Uh, anyways, uh, it's just it's just ironic because they have the back the blue, which is like the the flag for showing your support to the police, right? And it's like she was a prosecutor and she held people in jail for an extended period of time, and she even like lied and withheld information in one case to um to to keep somebody in jail. Okay, so my bad. I I will retract what I said here. Uh, an appeal court found Kamala Harris and police took part in framing prosecuting a man for a murder he didn't commit paying a key witness 60,000 in relocation benefits for testifying i wasn't i didn't know about the 60,000 but i was talking about that but she did what i was talking about was she took part in like framing it and making sure that this guy was stayed guilty even though he wasn't guilty it's a half truth what was the truth though was Kamala Harris was a district district attorney in San Francisco Cisco when Jamal True Love was arrested and tried for murder but she did not prosecute the case one of her deputies did so it wasn't her in particular but it was somebody in her office so that's where i had made the mistake was i thought it was her directly but it was actually someone in her office prosecutors placed a key witness in witness protection according to court filings and paid for her room and board true love who was found guilty appealed his conviction and the appeal court ruled that he deserved a new trial on grounds of prosecution misconduct and an ineffective lawyer true love was acquitted in the second trial and he filed a civil lawsuit against the city and county of san francisco and city police alleged officers framed him for murder Harris was not named in the suit true love won and received 13.1 million dollars so it wasn't her directly it was someone in her office so for that i will apologize i thought she was directly in 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 correlation with this case um but no it was it was just somebody in her office underneath her So this is why you also have to do research, right? You can't just believe everything that's, you know, you read on the internet or you find out there. You you got to you got to do a little bit of digging, you know? You got to do a little bit more digging. And I'm glad that I found this. And we've had some bad radical far left extremist aurat hai ye. Isko vote doge. ये है मुद्दा अभी प्रेसिडेंशियल इलेक्शन इन द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स ऑफ अमेरिका ट्रंप ने कमला की हंसी को भी मुद्दा बनाने की कोशिश की है देखिए कितने गंभीर मुद्दे डिस्कस हो रहे हैं फ्रॉम द मोमेंट वी टेक बैक द व्हाइट हाउस फ्रॉम क्रुकेट जो बाइडेन एंड कमाला आई कॉल अ लाफ एंड कमाला यू एवर वॉच अ लाफ शी इज क्रेजी यू नो यू कैन टेल व्हेन आई कॉल हर क्रेजी कमाला और कमाला क्रेजी और समथिंग देन लाफिंग कमाला कम ऑन Trump is known for giving people names and and joking about people's appearances or physical traits. It's like you get an old in age uh Trump, you got to you got to come up with something better than laughing Kamala. Now she does have a weird laugh, I will admit. I, I'm not a fan of her laugh, but I mean, we we're stuck with the laugh we're born with, right? So we can't we can't change that, can we? It's just it's just weird that there's so much wrong with Trump as well. and i'm sure I mean, trump was president for 4 years and then of course he had you know all these controversies for the past 4 years as well if you were on the internet you know about you know everything all the wrong doings with trump as well like how um you know he you know paid off um a porn star after sleeping with her or you know doing all these misdeeds and 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 fudging the books with his businesses up in new york and you know all, all sorts of things so it's like It is it is a laughing stock. It really really truthfully is. A lot by a laugh. No, she's crazy. She's nuts. Ab Trump ko kya muddo par debate karna padega? Aise mein Trump ne keh diya ki Kamala jaise Marxist fraud ke sath wo debate karna hi nahi chahte hain. No, he didn't say that. Kyunki abhi to Democratic Party khud hi confused hai ki unka nominee kaun hai. Magar Kamala No, okay, hold on. So he didn't refuse to debate her. 
Uh, he was just he just wanted to wait. Given the continued political chaos surrounding crooked Joe Biden, Democratic Party, yada yada yada, the strong sense by many Democratic Party, namely Barack Hussein Obama, uh, that Kamala Harris is a Marxist fraud who cannot beat President Trump, and there and they still holding out for someone better. Therefore, I would be inappropriate to schedule things with Harris before because Democrats fear. Yeah, so this was before even Obama backed her right like she just very recently at the time of this video she just very recently got all the votes she needed to um actually become the president or the the presidential candidate for the democratic party and i don't even think they've officially assigned her yet as the presidential candidate but it's, it's going to be her because there's nobody else that's running against her so this this was this was in correlation to at the time she wasn't specifically designated now after the fact i don't know if he's going to say it here after the fact he said he would debate kamala but not on one particular news channel but on another news channel so and then kamala had turned that down because it wasn't on this other news channel and it's just like it, why are we deciding our debates on which news channel is covering it that's crazy the democratic party could he confused hai crazy ki unka crazy crazy मगर कमला का कहना है कि वो एकदम तैयार है ब्रिंग इट ऑन आई टुक ऑन परपेट्रेटर्स ऑफ ऑल काइंड क्रेडिटर्स हु अब्यूज्ड वुमेन फ्रॉडस्टर्स हु रिप्ड ऑफ कंज्यूमर्स चीटर्स सो हियर मी व्हेन आई से आई नो डोनाल्ड ट्रंप्स टाइप मीनवाइल ट्रंप अपना वाइस प्रेसिडेंशियल कैंडिडेट चुन चुके हैं जिनको कई लोग क्रिंज नफरती कैंडिडेट बुला रहे हैं ऐसा कैंडिडेट जिसको खास जनता की पकड़ भी नहीं है जोक्स तक लैंड नहीं करवा पाते हैं जेडी बैंस 1980 के बाद पहले ऐसे वाइस प्रेसिडेंशियल कैंडिडेट हैं जिनकी कैंपेन के फेज में ही फेवरेबल रेटिंग नीचे नेगेटिव में चली गई है वैंस बहुत कोशिश तो कर रहे हैं कि ट्रंप की तरह वो लोगों को हंसा पाए मगर बात कुछ बन नहीं रही एक रैली में उनका जोक इतनी बुरी तरीके से बॉम्ब कर दिया कि भैया वैंस ने ना लाफ ट्रैक अपना अपने आप ही दे दिया इट इज दस्ट थिंग टू मी डेमोक्रेट से I had a diet Mountain Dew yesterday, and one today. I'm sure they're going to call that racist too, but it's good. <laughs> That's weird, I love you guys. <laughs> but क्या पता जो कोई स्पॉन्सर सेगमेंट हो कि माउंटेन ड्यू के साथ उनकी कोई कॉर्पोरेट स्पॉन्सरशिप हो ये भी थ्योरी चल रही है. वैसे इसी जेडी वैंस ने 2016 में ट्रंप को मॉरल डिजास्टर. A moral disaster. America's Hitler? Hitler okay. fraud far right wing supporter base को consolidate किया जाए क्योंकि जेडी वैंस अपनी anti women anti gay remarks के लिए काफी famous है We're effectively run in this country via the Democrats via, via our corporate oligarchs. by a bunch of childless cat ladies who are miserable at their own lives and the choices that they've made and so they want to make the rest of the country miserable too. If you look at Kamala Harris, Pete Buttigieg, AOC, the entire future of the Democrats is controlled by people without children. Iske saath saath JD Vance Huh, okay. I don't see anything wrong with what what he just said there. But if he's like targeting gay people? Oh, is it because is, is Pete Buttigieg gay? Is that why? Also, also said that to counter such single ladies and gay people, I didn't know P Pete Buttigieg was gay. I don't think that was a statement against gay people. Yeah, he okay. So he said that he was wanting people in charge to have like family, a familial connection, right? I didn't know Harrison have kids either. Again, I don't really pay too much attention to that sort of thing. I guess. ये भी कह चुके हैं कि ऐसे सिंगल लेडीज और गे लोगों को काउंटर करने के लिए इलेक्टोरल सिस्टम में ही कुछ तरीके का फेर बदल करना चाहिए लेट्स गिव वोट्स टू ऑल दिस आई डिड सी दिस दिस वाज क्रेजी बट लेट्स गिव कंट्रोल ओवर दोस वोट्स टू द पेरेंट्स ऑफ दोस चिल्ड्रन यू शुड हैव मोर पावर 
you should have more of an ability to speak your voice in our democratic republic than people who don't have kids. Let's face the consequences and the reality. <laughs> that that's weird. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't I don't agree with that. <laughs> ये नहीं बताया कि वोट का कंट्रोल मम्मी को जाएगा या पापा को जाएगा वैसे ये जेडी वैंस का महिलाओं को कैट लेडीज बुलाना भी वन ऑफ नहीं है लेकिन जब जेडी वैंस का नाम वीपी के लिए सामने आया उनके बुरे दिन तभी से शुरू हो गए थे यहां तक कि एक वायरल फेक न्यूज फैली जहां ये वायरल फेक न्यूज स्प्रेड इन व्हिच ही वाज सेड दैट ही हैड आह ही एडमिट्स दैट इट वाज वायरल एंड फेक ओह माय गॉड थैंक यू so many people just run with it being true i hate when misinformation is spread you should have said it at the very beginning because if somebody just watched the very beginning and then stopped watching your video and didn't get this far they would have assumed it was real bataya gaya ki unhone apne hi kitab mein likha hai ki unhone sofe ke sath ji ha sofe ke sath sambhog kiya hai halaki vance ne aisa kabhi kuch na likha hai ya aisa kuch hone ka praman nahi hai ye news america mein sabse badi khabar ban gayi presidential debate aur wo chhodo ye news sabse badi thi aur memes ka mano olympic fest shuru ho gaya ho ek taraf ye couch scandal chal raha okay raha tha dusri taraf pura right wing eco racist comments on the other hand right wing ecosystem was full of anti women racist comments is she indian or black trump questions harris identity as black journalist convention interesting okay system bhar bhar kar de- oh i saw this she yeah okay i i know what he's okay yeah she's the he was referring to her like flip flopping on who she is cuz you know one moment she's she's going around saying she's indian and she's she's doing that to get political views then she's saying she's black to get political views and right now she's very strong with the saying she's black and like i said there are even videos of her like faking ebonics that she's never done or said before and it's 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 it just comes off as super cringe and super pandering डेमोक्रेटिक पार्टी पॉलिटिशियंस पर एंटी वुमेन रेसिस्ट कमेंट्री कर रहा था ट्विटर पर ऐसे हेट स्पीच की आंधी आ गई कि ये मत और और ये मत सोचिए कि इलॉन मस्क इस सबको रेगुलेट करेगा कंट्रोल करेगा उल्टा इलॉन मस्क अपने आप को न्यूट्रल कहलाने वाला ट्रंप के कैंपेन को पैसा देने के इलॉन डोनेट साइजेबल अमाउंट टू ट्रंप्स कैंपेन हैव हेड ऑफ यूएस पोल्स he done like like Plans 40 million, million right par uske bawajood trump ke sabse badi election problem continue ho rahi hai ki centrist aur undecided voters hmm. wo dheere dheere kamla harris ke taraf ja rahe hain latest polls mein kamla aur trump basically barabar ki ratings par aa chuke hain again se, who, who's running these polls like who who's 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 getting polled for these polls जेडी वैंस जैसा हार्डकोर राइट विंग कैंडिडेट सेंट्रिस्ट वोटर्स को बैकफायर कर रहा है उनके ऊपर और वो भी डेमोक्रेट्स की तरफ जा रहे हैं कमला हैरिस की तरफ जा रहे हैं ये भी खबर है कि ट्रंप वैंस को रिप्लेस करना चाहते हैं एक मॉडरेट कैंडिडेट अगर really? उन्हें मिल जाए लेकिन याद रखिए मॉडरेट से भी काम नहीं बनेगा पिछली बार याद है माइक माइक पेंस वॉज वियर्ड पेंस काम नहीं आए ओपनली आज उन्हीं के प्रीवियस वाइस प्रेसिडेंट कह रहे हैं कि पिछली बार ट्रंप ने इलेक्शन ओवरटर्न करने की कोशिश की थी इससे बड़ा और क्या वार्निंग मिल सकता है अमेरिका को आई वांट द अमेरिकन पीपल टू नो दैट आई हैड नो राइट टू ओवरटर्न द इलेक्शन देन ऑन दैट डे प्रेसिडेंट ट्रंप आस्क मी टू पुट हिम ओवर द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन बट आई चोज द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन तो कहानी अब इंडिपेंडेंट वोटर्स की है क्योंकि राइट विंग तो वैसे में ही ट्रंप के पॉकेट में है and again christians get out and vote just this time it'll be fixed it'll be fine you won't have to vote anymore my beautiful christian agar trump yahan serious hai to wo khule aam that okay so that statement was in regards to the people that normally don't go out and vote I don't think it was a legitimate thing of him saying that he will make it so nobody has to vote anymore. He just he was appealing to the people that normally don't vote because in the US it's different from places like uh India for example in this last election and a large the vast majority of Indians actually went out and vote. In the US it's something like 50 or 60% of Americans vote and that's it. So here's a Pew Research article. The elections of 2018, 2020, 2022 were three of the highest turnout US elections were in the respective about 2/3, 66% of the voting eligible population turned out for the 2020 presidential election. Um the, tw- uh, the 2018 midterm election 50% showed up. So uh yeah, only 2/3 of the population actually came out and voted. in the 2020 presidential election. So, this statement right here was not in reference to 
um, the people that it, 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 it wasn't it wasn't telling people that come out and vote and you and then there's not going to be any more voting. It was people it was telling people that typically don't go and vote to come out and vote. And yeah, I, I don't I don't think this is him saying that there isn't going to be any more votes after. हम कह रहे हैं कि मुझे जिता दो उसके बाद ऐसा सिस्टम टाइट करूंगा ऐसा लोगों को टाइट करूंगा कि वोट करने की जरूरत ही नहीं पड़ेगी वारे मदर ऑफ डेमोक्रेसी अमेरिका गजब स्टेटमेंट दिया और यही अमेरिका दूसरे डेमोक्रेसीज को पाठ पढ़ाता है डेमोक्रेसी के बारे में लिबरल वैल्यूज के बारे में अगर सच्ची में ट्रंप जेडी वैंस को रिप्लेस करते हैं तो शायद सबसे ज्यादा दुखी होंगे इंडियन अंकल्स क्योंकि उषा चिलकुरी व्हाइट हाउस तक नहीं पहुंच पाएंगी अंकल लोग इस बात को भूल जाएंगे कि ट्रंप इंडियन स्टूडेंट्स के लिए और जॉब वीजा ढूंढने वाले इंडियंस के लिए particularly once many once much immigration legal or illegal going on right now ye koi khaas zyada kar nahi paaye kuch kaun legal indian immigrant hai kaun illegal hai trump ke far right base ko na aur unke ideology ko zyada farak uh i don't know about that far right base is not care they see everyone with hate i don't i don't think that's true nahi padta hai wo sabko ek hi hate ki nigahon se dekhte hain अमेरिका में कई वोटर खास करके नौजवान वोटर ये सवाल भी उठा रहे हैं नो आई डोंट थिंक शी विल शी बी एक्सट्रीमली सेंट्रिस्ट आई शी बी मोर सेंट्रिस्ट देन देन बाइडेन एंड बराक ओबामा आई 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 थिंक इफ थिंग्स वर्न्ट सो पोलराइज्ड राइट नाउ ऑन टू द फार लेफ्ट एंड फार राइट कामला हैरिस वुड वुड प्रोबेबली बी लाइक अ सेंट्रिस्ट रिपब्लिकन बट without the, how stretched and think how stretched and polarized the country is right now she's a, a democrat ki kya kamla harris koi actual progressive change la payengi american youth abhi bhi student loan ke crisis se jooj rahe hain wahan ka health care system yep. literally ek organized paisa vasooli pharmaceutical mafia ban chuka hai housing aur rent logo ki kamar tod raha hai aur is sab ke beech mein america billions of dollar kharch kar raha hai dusre deshon ke jab yeah, mein this this is what i have issues with is we're we're sending billions of dollars in aid uh oh constantly over and over again now admittedly a lot of that aid aid money is locked behind weapons and equipment so it's not actual you know cash liquid but at the same time it's like okay well if you're going to spend a billion dollars on this one particular weapon and then we're just going to give that weapon to Ukraine why why are we spending this money on that weapon why not spend it on something else right so it's a bit of a, a bit of a weird situation I would I would prefer I like I like that we're supporting Taiwan. We're 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 strategically supporting Taiwan um so they don't get completely taken over by China. But like Ukraine and Israel I don't know. Or genocide go support karne mein अभी वॉर क्रिमिनल नेतन्याहू अमेरिकन कांग्रेस में आए और डेमोक्रेट हो या रिपब्लिकन एक दो को छोड़कर सभी बैठ के तालियां बजा रहे थे जूस फॉर पीस और कुछ और ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ने प्रोटेस्ट किया ये याद दिलाने की कोशिश की कि आज के लिटरल हिटलर को आप सभा में बुला रहे हो जो बंदा इंटरनेशनल कोर्ट ऑफ जस्टिस में भी उनके रूलिंग में भी गिल्टी है इसराइल को अपाथाइड स्टेट बुलाया गया है उसको आप अमेरिका बुला रहे हो और उसको आप कांग्रेस में बोलने का मौका दे रहे हो और फिर पूरे दुनिया भर में डेमोक्रेसी का ढिंडोरा पीट रहे हो अमेरिका में कुछ नौजवान कह रहे हैं कि वो तो भाई इलेक्शन को ही बॉयकॉट करने वाले हैं सिस्टम ऐसा हो गया है कि दो पार्टी more unlikely they would have voted for Kamala Harris and in that instance then Trump will win will gain win the complete control ho gaya hai dono ko win education health care chhod kar genocide par focus karte rehte hain unke paas option hi nahi hai ab nota option hota nahi hai american elections mein kabhi kabhar ko shak ho jata hai ki american democracy democracy hai ya ek corporate funded two party dictatorship yahan chal rahi hai चलिए इस पर आप खुद अपनी राय बताइए कमेंट सेक्शन पर मगर इतना तो साफ है कि अमेरिका का जो ट्रेजी कॉमिक इलेक्शन शो चल रहा है उसके बाद अमेरिका का कोई हक नहीं बनता है कि वो बाकी दुनिया को जाकर डेमोक्रेसी का पाठ पढ़ाए डेमोक्रेसी के बारे में लेक्चर दे अगली बार कोई अमेरिकन होस्ट कोई अमेरिकन ज्ञानी वेस्टर्न वैल्यूज और अमेरिकन डेमोक्रेसी के बारे में अगर कोई लंबी चौड़ी भाषण दे तो आप उसे यह कह दीजिएगा I really don't know what he said at the end of that sentence. I don't think he knows what he said either. Okay.
Interesting. Very, very, very interesting. Um, yeah, so I think you get my my piece and all that. I did talk throughout the entire video, so um, make sure to go and check out this video. The link will be in the description down below. Um, I didn't catch how to pronounce this name. Deshbacht? Deshbach? Deshbacht? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I'm sure someone will correct me in the, uh, the comments, so... Uh, I think it's a good idea to read a couple comments. Now, this being a newer video, we're not going to read any of the new comments because they're all basically going to be new comments. So, we'll just start from the top, read a couple of them, and then we'll go ahead and, and call it a day there. Um, every American politician and presidential candidate are funded by the APAC lobby. The, um, the That's the Israel something, right? I don't know. It's it's the is, is Israeli whatever it is. Anyways, I can't stop seeing Kamala's laugh at 53. Not sure why politicians all around the world are turning themselves into laughing stocks by doing weird acts nowadays. It's the age of social media. You have to... You have to become more flamboyant and more boisterous for the camera than you had to before. Can we have a, Can we also have a prime ministerial debate in our country? At least the day they debate and a person of different color, religion, can run fair and square in the U.S. Despite the hiccups, their democracy is still far more robust than ours. And that's the sad reality. Rip democracy, mother of all democracy. Indian prime minister, Indian opposition leader, U.S. president, U.S. opposition leader. Love from Bangladesh. Both in Bangladesh. Missing. Yeah. Tragic what's happening in Bangladesh. Uh, good thing we don't have a prime minister. Debates in India, else all stand-up comics will be out of business. Vinesh Pogets should be given a chance. I don't, I don't know who that is. Um, American election be like you got the power to choose from Corona or Corolla, Corolla, Co Cho Cholera. I have no idea what he's saying there. Cholera. Okay, that is how you spell cholera. Corona or cholera. Oh, I was thinking like he was talking about... God, what is that beer? There's a beer that's like a corona. <laughs> he was talking about the coronavirus or cholera. I see. Good to see an Indian take on American elections. Refreshing and much needed amongst the common topics back home. Just a few days ago, uh, said we all see pro-USA con contents. Okay, um, thanks. 900 Indian rupees, nice. Uh, neither Hindi is bad for, or, wait, wait, wait. Neither Hindi is bad nor Muslim is bad. The person who is doing wrong is bad. Okay, um, stress is reduced by watching the videos. Uh, along with it, new light is also found. The answer to the question, hats off, sir. You are a great explainer of every video. People who are wearing masks. Okay. America is winning gold in shooting. Irony. Yeah, we're good shots. What can I say? Dude, love your consistency. Awesome videos continue the series. Will you not raise awareness of what's being done to Hindus in Bangladesh? No, because he is blind. What Modi is doing? Question mark. Modi needs to save Hindus in Bangladesh. Because he is greedy and he has sold his soul for money. You can see the the cunning demeanor in his eyes. I don't know why others don't see it. Bengal has been cheated time after time because of the people like him. I don't care about other YouTubers, but at least he being a Bengali should be, have taken a stand. Who knows, even his ancestors were once uh, from Bangladesh who ran away because of certain religious extremisms. Okay. Um, <laughs> lots of love, support from Punjab. Um, watching from the USA, nice, make more international videos like this, love from Kashmir, uh, please make more episodes of American Election in the future, please make video on injustice with Vanish, I don't, oh, okay, so there, there must be something going on with this person, I, I don't, I don't know anything, uh, with that, um, don't trust media, Bangladesh Hindus are not safe. So what's going on with Bangladesh Hindus, guys? Let me know. Nice episode. Um, it seems enough money is received. Okay. Am not overweight. Vinesh is. 
Okay. Biden may even give Trump his password instead of a handshake. Oof. Okay. Well, interesting. I, I, I see. I feel like this, this, this comment section would be a lot more enthralling if we had just waited a couple days to actually go down and read it. I might go back and read it. I don't know. I'll keep this on the back burner and, and uh, maybe we'll take a look at it. But yeah, interesting. All right. Well. With that being said, guys, thank you for watching. Remember, again, go check out the, the link to this uh, channel. This video will be in the description. And, um, yeah, uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you later. Take care. Goodbye.